Friday today is Friday and it is about 7 15 right now and I just pulled up to the gym it's a nice Friday night it's actually really foggy out here y'all it is I don't know what this is but we've had a few days of like haze it looked like twilight out here it's kind of scary visibility is not that bad but it's not that great either I'll try to see if I can catch it like on the way home you might be able to like kind of see it in the background but yeah it's kind of weird anyways y'all I'm finna get in here and get this workout started and I will check in with y'all later I'm exhausted and I'm kind of hungry um thinking about getting some Taco Bell uh, um yeah I saw a Taco Bell commercial while I was on the treadmill and that should look really good so I'm not on a diet if you guys are like wondering like how on earth you can't you just coming out the gym I'm gonna go get something to eat but yeah um, I had a bakeable pizza last night and I still have some of that left but like I kind of don't want that so yeah, Taco Bell it is, y'all. Look at how crazy it looks out here. I'm going to show y'all. Like, it is so crazy. So, yeah, this is the type of weather that we have been dealing with today. And it is so dreary. So dreary. It's damn near spooky out here. Thank you for choosing Taco Bell. Do you mind looking over the menu for one moment? Sure, no problem. Thank you. All right, what can I get started for you? Uh, may I have two soft shell taco supremes with no tomato? Two soft shell taco supremes? Anything else? Uh, two of the Dorito local taco supremes, no tomato. Do you want no tomatoes on the soft shell tacos as well? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Give me one second. Anything else? That'll be it. That's all for you today. Any sauce? Uh, mild, please. All right. Is everything on that screen correct for you? Uh, yes. All right. Would you like to try to be total to the nearest dollar to support students today? Sure. All right. That is going to be $15 total at the second window. Okay. Thank you. Um, $15 for four tacos? I thought Taco Bell was what came in the clutch. Is that all tacos and tomato? Yes. Thank you. Me too. Good morning, you guys, and happy Saturday. Today is Saturday, and it's about 10 o'clock. Um, me and P slept in this morning. We slept in until about 7 a.m. And then we finally got up. <laughs> um, I've just had a slow morning. I've been having my coffee and watching the news. So much shit going on. Like, oh my gosh. Um, I'm not sure I should have started my day like that. But as you guys know, I worked out Thursday and Friday. So I was literally there last night. And y'all, I am I am so sore. My body hurts so freaking bad. I mean, I'm not complaining because, I mean, that means you're growing, right? But, gosh, so sore. Um, so, I really don't have much planned for the day at all. Um, I might do a little grocery shopping. I was thinking about, like, not placing an order and actually going into the store to do a little shopping because I haven't done that in so long. But see, that shit is dangerous, because that's when you start seeing some shit, you know what I'm saying? And be like, oh, I want that. But I don't know yet. I don't know yet. Um, the sun is out now, like, because I woke up this morning, y'all. It was 
still foggy, still hazy. I showed you guys a little bit of it last night. And ugh, that's such a buzzkill. So when I saw the sun shining, it kind of pepped me up and made me feel like, yeah, let's go outside. Because I think tomorrow's going to be rainy. And I also heard that they are um, predicting more fog. So, oh yeah, y'all. And the viral um, egg boil, I've been seeing that everywhere. And I want to try it. So, that is also something that I want to do today. Because that'll be great protein. Egg boil. Back, up, pop, and then that type of thing. That. Y'all, I'm trying to learn this dance. DJ I cannot get that. That's them. I can't get it. I'm gonna get it down. I'm gonna get it. hungry perfect timing for us to get into this egg boil Mm. 
not bad at all. Flavor wise, it's good. Mm. I'd try this again. Check it out, good protein. What's up y'all, happy Sunday. Today is Sunday and it is about 11.30 now. Um, I am up, cleaning up, straightening up, getting organized, doing some laundry. I'm not quite sure the last thing I recorded. Oh, I think it was the egg boil. Now, the egg boil came out, it came out good. Um, I kind of feel like I needed to use a little bit more seasoning. I wanted more like a robust flavor, like knock my socks off type of flavor. Um, and then I did not use chicken broth. I was supposed to use chicken broth and that I kept saying like, why am I just sucking up fucking butter? <laughs> but actually, you're supposed to use chicken broth, which I did not do. So I ate about four of them yesterday, halves, four halves, yesterday. And then I saved four for today. And this morning I had it in ramen noodles and it was so much better, y'all. I really enjoyed it that way. So um, next time I'll probably just make it with noodles. It's really good. Um, so after I ate the egg boil, I think I probably freaking took a nap or just laid around the house. Like yesterday, I pretty much did nothing. Um, and then around like 6 o'clock or so, I said, let me get up and get out of here and find me something to do. So I needed a uh, phone charger because the charger by my bed was uh, no good anymore. So I said, let me go to Five Below and grab a new charger and so I have been seeing that they have these cute Valentine's Day nightgowns on sale at Five Below like they come in like a couple different colors and styles so I went looking for that I got my charger my store that I checked did not have um, any of the other designs besides a red nightgown and I'm kind of kicking myself wishing that I had picked it up last night but I kind of wanted to hold out and check another store to see if I can find what I really really wanted um, I want the white one with the red hearts on it so uh, today I think because it's another rainy day um, but those are the best times for me to shop. I love shopping on a rainy day. I love shopping when there's snow outside. It's just something about it. So today, I think I want to try another five below and see what they have. But anyway, backtracking to what I did yesterday. I went to the five below. That's where I started. I did really good. I got the phone charger and I think I picked up like three toys for Penelope. No big deal. Then I went to the five below I mean then I went then I went to the Dollar Tree and I bought a whole bunch of unnecessary not unnecessary stuff honestly I bought a whole bunch of stuff from there I think I spent about $60 in the Dollar Tree so that wasn't too bad um, I picked up a whole bunch of cute little things that I could use um, just trying to see what they had and then after that I went into uh, PetSmart so I went into PetSmart looking for like you know around Valentine's Day and all the holidays they have like cute little cookies and treats for the dogs and they had nothing like nothing Valentine's Day related it was so strange so anyways I wound up walking in and walking out of there with nothing and then my last stop was at home um, and so my goal with that home was I needed like either a Valentine's Day door sign like the corner sign that I put um, or a doormat I needed a Valentine's Day doormat I needed a plain black doormat and I had saw that they had wall decor on sale for 50% off so I just wanted to go in there and see what they had I found my black um, doormat I saw nothing 
for Valentine's Day. I don't know what the hell is going on. Like, today is the 28th. The month is over in just a few days. And where is all the Valentine's Day stuff? But anyways, so I didn't see a Valentine's Day mat there. But I got my black mat and I found a really nice piece of art for 50% off. So it was, original price was $50. So I got it for $25. Bucks. So I'm going to show you guys what that looks like. It's really cute. And my vision is for it to go right here in this bedroom. Even though I was looking, I set out to find uh, pieces for the hallway. So I really wasn't expecting to find a piece for the bedroom, but I'm super happy with it. I think I like it. I haven't held it up here to see how it's going to look yet, but I'll show y'all what it looks like. Oh no, it's downstairs. Okay. So yeah, it's downstairs. But before I go down there, let me show y'all what I got. I'm just going to show y'all real quick the cute toys that I got for Pete. So at five below, they have these cute little hearts for a dollar. So I got her too. This one be mine. And sweetheart for a dollar. So cute. I already took the tags off of them. So I'm getting her little Valentine's Day stuff together. That's why I was super bummed that they didn't have any of the treats at the damn PetSmart. Like what the heck? Um, and then at Dollar Tree, they have these sets. I'm pretty sure you guys may have seen them already. Um, the peanut butter, the peanut butter to my jelly. I got her this one. I also got her a um, the donut and coffee one, but I couldn't hold that one. I wanted her to have that, so I gave it to her. She's playing with it now. Um, there is the donut. <laughs> Where's the coffee? Show me where the coffee is. There is the coffee one. So cute. And then this was a set. Super adorable. I love them for a dollar. She loves it too. Here, baby. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go down here and show y'all what the painting looks like. So here is the piece of art. I am not quite sure if it's upside down or whatever the case. I do plan to have it hanging horizontally though. I believe. But yeah, so. Regular price is $50 and it was on clearance, 50% off. So it's really nice, it's in great condition. There's nothing wrong with it at all. They just have like so many pieces. So that was the location closest to me. There is another location that I'm thinking about going to see what they got in their clearance section for 50% off because yeah, I could really clean up and get all my wall art up if I do that. So we'll see, we'll see what happens. That's also one of the places I wanted to stop at today. But you know, once I get outside, I'd be ready to get back in the house. And let me show you guys these planters that I picked up. I got these from the Dollar Tree. They were $3 for these big ass flower pots. Look. These are pretty big. It's a pretty big pot. So I picked up two of them for $3. You can't beat that. Yeah, you, you really can't beat that. So it is a 14 inch planter. And then I picked up one of these little cute things. It's sitting here on the stairs because it needs to go downstairs. Cute little water thing, water dispenser. For $1.25, this is super cute. I'm gonna put that in her little house downstairs. So that's where she spends her time when her ass is in trouble <laughs> and when I leave the house. So this is gonna be great. So that is how I spent my Saturday evening. It was fun, it was cute. Um, and I didn't spend a lot of money. I'm proud of myself. Proud of myself, so I'm thinking about doing round two tonight because that was so much fun, but we'll see.